homework in reception year one and year two. So this week, your child, all, all children will come home with a plastic wallet. And inside that plastic wallet is their reading record, reading books, homework book, and a sheet with a hard to read and spell words. The reason for the plastic wallet is to make sure that all our new reading books are kept safe and not damaged from water. So please ensure that all books are returned inside the plastic folder. So inside, first of all, you've got your reading record. I've been through, got, I've done videos on how to support your child reading these two books, but just to let you know, from next week, or from this week, sorry, your child will have a little blending book in year one and a decodable book. In reception, they'll only have a blending book um, for the foreseeable future, but in year one and two, they'll have one of each of these books to bring home with them. Uh, like I said, these are further videos to show you how to support children in reading both these books on our YouTube and on our dojo as well. Then your child, for the first time, will bring up, bring home a homework book. So when you open up, that is a spelling sheet linked to the sounds that have been taught that week uh, in school. And this again is in reception year one and year two. So the first thing you need to do with your child is practice the phonemes. So in each section, these are the phonemes that your child has taught, been taught this week in school. And what we've done to make it easier for you, that's the sound it makes, but as a teaching alternative sound, we put that next to it. So that's the A, that's an alternative A. That's an L, that's the alternative L. I, I, E, E. So that's the sound it makes, you know you might go in phase two or phase three, but now we're in year one, especially in year two, there's using alternative sounds that have been taught in school. So first of all, just practice sounding out those. Then the next job, would be the formation. So your teacher will have done a video on the sounds, how to say them, and they've also done a formation video. So watch that video, then you can support your child with that at home. That'll be posted each week on Dojo for the parents to see. Next job, orally blend the words with your child. Again, there's a further video for that, but orally blending. So the first word is where, it's just going w, a, where. Next word is play, p, u, a, play. And do that with your child. You do it first, me, then you. So you do it first, you go me, so do play again, so me, p, u, a, play, you, and get your child to copy what you've done. Or if you're still not sure, get the children to do it with you, take it in turns, who does me, then you. Next job is to then do the spelling sequence. Now the spelling sequence for ease has been placed in the front of the book, but again, there's another video to show you about spelling as well. So this sequence is a further video to show you how to do that, do that spelling sequence in a bit more detail. So for the spelling sequence, they've, not, they've done the formation, now they're going to write the word where. So what you need to do, whisper in the hands, where. Warm it up, stretch it out, where. Then rubber arms, w, a. Blending hands, where. Then count it out, w, a, where. Two sounds of that word, then you attempt to write it. If they struggle at any point, then do any letters in that word, they go back to the beginning of the, spe the spelling sequence to help them. Um, following that, they write it out three times using a spelling sequence each time to help them. Then at the bottom of the page, you've got your harder to read and spell words. So for here, the children are going to write these harder to read and spell words. The children have been taught what's tricky about them, what's hard. So what they need to do is write these harder to read and spell words and they're going to use the letter names this time to do it. So O would be O and H makes the O. O and H, O and H, you set, then you've got to write it out three times. There would be T-H-E-I-R makes the word there. And then the hard to read spell words that don't sound out. And that's it. All your homework is done. So practice reading the hard to read and spell words, then practice spelling them. And we ask this is going to be turned on a Thursday to give a chance to the teachers to mark them and stick their new homework in. In addition, just for the time being as children are catching up, as I've already explained, they've got the hard to read and spell word sheet. So what we want to do with these ones, because it's a these have been taught prior in reception or in year one, depending on which year group you need to try and catch up. They've got one sheet in year one and two sheets in year two. Read the words and then practice spelling these words because these are all these words that they should know from reception. But as you know, we've only introduced the skiing this year, so we're trying to play a bit of catch up. I hope you find this video useful. Like I said, there is an oral blending video there for your help and the segmenting video is there for your help too. So please refer back to those. Any questions, please just let me or your class teacher know. Thank you.